A possibility for severe weather is coming here by this afternoon. Just not great timing for some of those field trips that uh, school leaders have planned all across the area today. And there are a lot today. Erie News Now's Jacob Brooks is live at the Erie Zoo, one of the places where there will be quite a few kids and teachers today. Good morning, Jacob. Yeah, quite a few kids for sure. About four to five different schools will be here today. And right behind me, this is where they'll be coming in, the education entrance. It's a busy day for the zoo, but the zoo says they are ready if storms hit. The zoo does severe weather drills throughout the year. This makes sure they're ready if storms or any bad weather comes. It can be everything from snowstorms to tornadoes to uh, floods. We, we do a different kind of drill. Um, for each of those. While weather related closures are rare, Scott says they have happened. We did close several times last year because of air quality, which was a whole nother issue. If a severe storm hits, they'll take people inside to buildings across the zoo. As for the animals, zookeepers take the smaller ones in crates. They'll try to move the bigger animals to a bedroom off their exhibit. Like the leopards and lynx and tiger, those, those uh, buildings that they're in are really, really well built. If the zookeepers can't get them to move on their own, they'll use what's called a recall system. There's special words that are said or special noises that are used, and then they get a very, 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 very special treat, one they only get in a recall because it's an emergency. But some animals don't need move. They're already inside because they could sense the storms were coming. Oftentimes, uh, like the llamas and alpacas will go inside their building. Sometimes the cats will react a little bit, but most of them know it's coming before we do. So UPMC Park's also going to be really busy. The Seawolves have their education game coming up in a few hours. The team says they're not really concerned about the weather today. They're more focused on the game, and they have a lot of tools to monitor the weather, including our free Erie Weather app. So if you're looking for a reason to download it, there you go. Seawolves approved. Live at the Zoo, I'm Jacob Brooks, Erie News Now. Thank you for that, Jacob. Of course, 11.05 is that first right. pitch down at UPMC Park. When you're the defending Eastern League champs, you got to focus on the game because, right. you know, that's important. We want to defend that title. Here's hoping for a win for them.